This episode's food was chosen by my dear old friend, Beth Eunice, and she wanted me to try circus peanuts, the candy. Uh, not only have I never tried a circus peanut, I have never seen a human mammal eat one. So this should be an experience. Let's see what happens. All right, first we'll take, well, that's not a good sign. Oh, all right, ju oh, just in the hand. It is both too hard and too soft at the same time. Let's go ahead and try it. Oh, what? I is that banana? Oh my! Oh, <laughs> oh! It's like you're chewing banana, banana wallpaper paste. I don't know why, but this tastes like what childhood lymphoma would taste like. Nope, nope, nope. Hello, hello. Peanut should sue over this. This is slander. There's a John Waters movie where Divine picks up an actual dog turd and eats it, and that is not nearly as much of a challenge as this is right now. This is what candy would be if only Stephen King was allowed to make candy. The consistency is really kind of like if a marshmallow and Play-Doh had unconsensual sex. I'm not gonna lie, I owe candy corn an apology, slightly. All right, everyone, I'm Brad Lokley, and that's been me attempting to eat circus peanuts. Uh, caution and public warning, please don't. They're monstrous. However, one of you has already sent me a recipe for a circus peanut salad that apparently was a southern delicacy in the 1960s. So I'm going to attempt to make it now, and then I'm going to eat it in front of you for the next episode, and then I'm probably going to walk into the ocean and die. See you soon.